Well, let's get into what's happening right now. And at the top of the news, someone that you have been romantic with before, allegedly, Gabriel Union, Gabby. called out Boosie. Called out Boosie. Gabby? What'd she say? Gabby. Well, she did an interview, and they talked about some of Boosie's comments about her, uh, you know, stepson. Oh. The trans, the transgender one. Yeah. And, uh, you know, Boosie had made some comments on Vlad TV and other platforms and so forth. And she said that she kind of replied that Boosie was gay. <laughs> yeah, we did. And uh, she said he got a lot of dick on his mind. <laughs> Gabby, Gabby's tough now. She ain't no pushover. She ain't no pushover. She's she's tough. I mean, you know, she. I mean, she's fighting for a family. I, you know, I, you know, I, I could never. Whenever I. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't really comment on shit like that because it ain't my. I know that um. When I was a kid, I wanted to be Spider Man. <laughs> and I want there's two things. I want actually I want to be Bruce Lee. And I wanted to be a dirt bike riding um, champion. And my father told me, niggas, you crazy. So, um, you know, go, I would put my gear on and go outside and fight people. <laughs> my father was like, what's wrong with you? Then uh, people started getting dirt bikes. James Boone. Had a dirt bike. He was delivering on his um, on, on uh, he was delivering uh, uh, papers on his dirt bike. I'm like, Pop, we got. I got to get a dirt bike. He's like, Boy, is you crazy? He said, Let's just go down there and see how much they cost. Dirt bike back then was twenty five hundred. My bought shit, shit. You must be crazy. Twenty five hundred dollars a lot of money back then, right? But James Boone was like, all you gotta do is get a paper route and pay $60 a month or some shit like that. I'm like, all you gotta do is get a paper route. Pretty soon, everybody in the neighborhood, arms was like this on cask and shit. <laughs> They're going to school with necks like this and shit. <laughs> but the girls was like signing the cast, so it was cool. I'm like, daddy, I really gotta get a dirt bike. <laughs> I, wanna, I want people to sign my cast. He's like, nigga, is you crazy? So thank God he didn't let me get a dirt bike until I was 17. I bought my own dirt bike. Because those decisions, kids, kids want to do anything. That's you know, that's all I can say. It's like my father did that to me. He's like, you know, is you is you out of your fucking mind? So, but well, Boosie actually responded to her. <laughs> he said, LOL, the whole world know I love women. The world knows your husband loves dick. Hope you don't think blacks look at y'all like a power couple. They don't. I refuse to talk about y'all in interviews, and here you go. Go bang him with that dildo and wait on a script, you little white girl. Wow. Then he said, women, you better leave me alone. How dare you challenge a ghetto hero's manhood? You wrong, shaking my head. I don't have the time for this. I'm trying to have peace in my life and stay alive. Now, I don't, I don't know whether Dwayne Wade is, is gay or like dildos or nothing like that. This is just Boosie talking. I don't have no idea whether. I've never actually heard this myself. Maybe Boosie has information that I don't have. I don't know. But, but clearly, you know, Boosie was offended by the comments. So this was his response. Yeah, he's fighting fire with fire. So, you know, I mean, which is, which, I don't know where this energy is so, it's like a dark cloud that's coming over black America with this type of thing. I don't know, is it, I always say that, um, I don't, uh, and what do you call, how do you say it? I, I, I didn't been, um, <laughs> artificial intelligence is the devil. What I mean, it's like 
it's it's too much of it around, and it's too easy to say something to some about somebody, and there's all this negative fucking shit around. So I, I mean, I don't know. I don't I don't know that situation. I don't know why. Obviously, he, he spoke on the you know. I, <clears throat> I don't know why black Americans right now feel we need to go at each other. It's very, it's, it's, a, it's a very fucked up time. Herschel Walker might be the <laughs> governor of Atlanta, uh, Georgia. You understand that? Well, is he, wait, are they running, is he running for governor? Or is he running for? Uh, I don't know where he, I don't know where he's running, but he should run the fuck out the state or somewhere. But he's really running, like they really got go goofy blood running. Yeah, he's he's running for the Senate. He's not running for governor. Senate. But, I mean, still, it's a, it's an it's a very important position, right? So I don't know if this it's a slide of hands trick. I don't know what it is, but I'm like, Black America has to get their shit together, our shit together. Because, you know, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't want Bootsy and, you know, I love Gabby. Uh, and uh, um, I never met Dwayne, but, you know, I, as, as black Americans in the struggle, we, we can't be separating motherfuckers. I love Bootsy. We, we can't be separating motherfuckers like that at this time, because it's very crucial that we get shit together. It's very crucial. I don't know why it's all this poking and talking shit and, uh, you know, I don't, you know, I don't know. It doesn't, it, it, it's never, it, I, I've never seen the OJs talk about Lola Falana. Fuck that bitch. Well, yeah, it was. It was true. in her face. That's true, but but you know, in the age of social media, you do see R and B guys beefing with each other. That is really a thing. <laughs> you know, Tory Lanez and August Alsina had a fist fight. Uh, you know, that's good. Like they had a happened. fist fight. They had a fist fight. They, you know what? That's good. I, 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 they had a fist fight. Good. They should fist fight. Rumble, okay. Now, after that's over, sit down. Why do we have this fist fight, brother? <laughs> Why? You sing music? <laughs> Does that make sense? Yeah. No, I, I feel you. I feel you. I, by, I, by the I, way. Age now, Black, when I'm sick of it. I'm sick of hearing goofy shit. I'm sick of people hearing people dying for bullshit. Not even for a cause. For bullshit. Like for bullshit. And they, and they think it's cute. 